The custom image feature lets you quickly add images or icons to point hotspots without having to create or add a skin. But if you do have a skin, you can easily swap out hotspot images without editing the original skin. In this tutorial, we'll go over just the basics, but even more flexibility can be added to your skin if you add a custom image element to a hotspot template. And we'll cover this in another tutorial. Here I have a two node tour already connected with hotspots. And when I output this as it is, you'll see the default hotspot images, which are these red dots. I'd like to use my own icons here without adding a skin. So I'll go back to Pana2VR to add them. For this node, I'll open the point hotspot properties. And here, for custom image, I'll add my icon. And then I'll resize it. For the next node, I'll use a different icon. And this time, I'll select 3D Distorted, so the image will correctly distort with the panorama. Instead of adjusting the size with pixels, you adjust the field of view to determine its size. If you need to remove the image, you can right-click on the file name and choose Clear. This removes the image without removing the hotspot. The custom image is also used for when you want to override the default spinning globes in the WebVR output. In this case, you can adjust the distance field, which will set how far or near the hotspot is from the viewer. So this is what it looks like on output. This is the first icon we added. And here's the second one that's 3D distorted. And here's what it looks like in WebVR. The custom image feature can be used to swap out a hotspot image. And for this project, I'm using the Silhouette skin. I want to add a pop-up video to the project, so I'll just drag in a YouTube video. Now, let's see how this looks. It looks good, but I'd like to use a different icon for this video pop-up. So in Pana2VR, I'll find that hotspot, and for custom image, I'll navigate to the icon I want to use. I'll resize it, and finally, I'll save the project and output it. And now I have my custom image for the video pop-up and the silhouette skin. And that's using the custom image for point hotspots.